Hello, I'm Alistair from MSD Bikes. I work with uh, Marcus at Chorus to design a touring bike that will be very comfortable. Um, and to get this comfort, what we've actually done is, is to make the actual head tube actually taller than the conventional touring bike. The top tube is actually shorter. This gives the uh, rider a more upright riding position for comfort. Uh, we've, maxed the, we've made the chain stays long to give hill clearance and to give the bike a little bit more vertical compliance. We've actually got a new design on the rear dropout here uh, to actually adjust the chain tension on the roll off. We feel this is a better way of actually adjusting the chain rather than the conventional eccentric bottom bracket. It's very easy to adjust. We're going doing these screws here, both sides, and adjusting here to pull the chain back. It's a simple operation to do. It also has separate dropouts that can be changed. Uh, if you didn't want the uh, gear hanger here, we can actually produce it without the gear hanger. But we feel this is quite an important thing to have on a touring bike because if anything happens to the back wheel and the rear hub, you can go into any bike shop and get a, a rear derailleur on here um, with the, with the derailleur rear wheel and a shifter and you'll be away again. Um, design the um, actual um, similar hubs back in front where you actually put oil into, into the actual hubs to actually cut down maintenance, a much more efficient way of actually um, greasing your hub when you're actually touring than putting grease in you just all the hubs through here. Uh, we can put uh, uh, V-brakes on the frame, and we can also put um, cantilever brakes if you wanted to use dropped handlebars on it with uh, STI levers. Um, we can also fit disc brakes back in front. If, if you wish. Various racks we can fit, uh, old man mountain racks if you want to go suspension forks because the frame's been designed to be suspension ready. Uh, and as you can see it actually got the SS couplings here that we can actually take the bike apart and put it back together if you're going to do a long sort of trip um, where you can actually pack it into a box. We've actually made the um, single chain ring here um, it's a very strong material, so it's very durable, so if it takes bashes, it won't bend. It's got a very hard coating on it um, to, to be very durable, so it doesn't wear out quickly. We've used a stainless steel chain so it doesn't corrode. Um, also this frame, um, later on, um, we'll be actually have a gateway in here to use belt drive chooses about goes from back to front obviously maintenance free